at university you learn the law from a purely academic point of view. What you do in practice is you apply the law in a particular circumstances and you need to take other things into account, for instance, the commercial impact of the advice you're giving. If your client has a claim against a third party, theoretically you could sue the counterpart in the court. However, this will take time, it involves risks and uncertainty. So from a theoretical point of view, it would be a good option to go to the court, but in practice you may want to advise the client to settle the case to get the money rather sooner than later. Being business minded or being commercially minded is very much about getting into the head of the client and thinking first and foremost, what are they trying to do? What are their aims? What do they want out of this process? We really need to understand what their product does, who their competitors are, you know, what they're concerned about and the sort of things that they're faced with on a day-to-day -day basis. If you understand the business, you might be able to add something else that they haven't asked but that's actually very useful to them. Clients come to us because they want to know the answer to the legal questions and they, they want to know what they can do within the law. Clients don't want six pages of legal analysis, they want the answer. The client's not going to thank you when they come to you for advice about whether they can do a particular thing for you to say, no, the law says you can't do it. We need to be able to, to help them along and try and find solutions rather than just identify legal obstacles to their problems. That's what being commercially minded is all about, really, just identifying the client's needs and you know, delivering your service to meet those needs.